Today I'd like to tell you how the engine throttle lock works on this generation of machines. Simply put, it allows you to lock your engine RPM to have optimal flow for whatever hydromechanical tool you may be using. To do this, there's a few ways to go about it. You can simply use your throttle and then touch your set button, let off your throttle and your engine RPM is locked. At that point, if you would like to decrease or increase your RPM, you can press and hold your switch to decrease your RPM or press and hold your switch to increase your RPM. A simple press or a panic stop on the left brake pedal will kick that RPM out at that point. To tie all this together to show how everything is used when operating hydromechanical tools, set your engine RPM, get it where you would like, get your hydraulic flow going to where you would like, lock in your continuous flow, downshift to the point that your creeper comes on, then adjust your creep control where you need it to be. The best practice is to start low, go into forward, then not outrun your tool. For more information about this or any additional features, please contact your local cat dealer.